What's up, Tubers? It's your boy, Itchy, and I've got a quick video, and I'm going to talk to you about a great accessory for your iPad, iPhone, any device that uses the Lightning uh, port, and this is the Lightning to SD camera card reader. I like this because it gives you a lot of flexibility and versatility that you cannot get otherwise because it basically is a lightning port in and an SD card in and whatever's on that SD card you can transfer to your iPad or iPhone. This is cool and important because more and more apps are coming out like Photoshop Touch and other apps where you can do editing and things of that nature that you can do more on the iPad, more work and more um, you know, freelance or amateur work, cleaning up photos, uh, doing different things with them, emailing them to people. And sometimes you may want to take a quick picture and you may not have a camera that's wireless or you may not want to use that, that feature for whatever reason. And you can upload that to your um, iOS device, make edits on it if you have a pro if you have an app that will do that, or send it straight away and you can do it all through an SD card, which I think is really nice and it imports everything pretty natively. Let's unbox this thing and actually see what it looks like. Uh, this little device will run you about 20 bucks, which is reasonable, I guess. I mean, it's not too, too ridiculous. <laughs> and you can find it pretty much anywhere. Best Buy, any Apple store, almost any Walmart, pretty much anywhere that sells Apple products. Uh, the box is really small, looks about the size of a remote, a little bigger. Um, here's your Apple warranty paperwork, standard one year warranty from Apple. Here is the instructions on how this thing works, lightning the SD card reader, and it basically shows you, it plugs in, SD card in, and talks about the compatibility here, which is very important. It'll take an SD or SDHC memory card. Pretty sure it'll take almost any SD card, if I remember correctly. Here's the same thing in a few different languages, I'm sure. And that is that. Here's the actual device itself right here. And I guess this one's been up before. I don't know how, but that plastic shouldn't have been on the back like that. It should have been wrapping this. This one has definitely been opened. But who cares? I mean, I think it'll still work and do the same thing. You've got lightning there, you've got SD here, and let me whip out a one of my trusty SD cards, and it basically plugs into an iPad, like said. Good, secure plug-in, and then you install the card by following the way the card looks on the image and it looks like that so we'll take said card and and that's it and it's in and you get the actual deal and that's pretty much what it looked like oh sorry i didn't mean to bump that guys and that's it and it's in there pretty sturdy i mean it's actually very sturdy you import everything you need and when you finish you pop this guy out um, let me know what you guys think. Let me know if you have uh, this particular attachment for your iPad and what you do have for your iPad that helps you get work done. I'm dying to hear in the comments. Again, this is the Lightning to SD camera, uh, excuse me, card camera reader. Say that 10 times fast from Apple. Run you about 20 bucks. You can get it anywhere. And I think it is an excellent um, peripheral to have for your um, iOS device. That's all I got. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please comment. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you want to see. More videos to come. That's all I got. See you in the next one. Peace.